This is the news, TBS. I'm here with um, Margarita. And um, there's some controversy of uh, cheetah. Did you witness the cheetah? I, I saw the cheetah. I was uh, hanging up my clothes because they had to dry because I don't have a dryer. I was hanging up my clothes on the line and I look over and there's a, there's a big cheetah. It was just a big cheetah. And I, I called for my husband and he bring out his gun. He, he brought out his gun and he shot the no, cheetah. No. Uh, he brought out his gun and he shot the cheetah. Um, what kind of a gun was it? Um, it's, it's very legal. It's a very legal gun. And it's a marshmallow shooter and it shoots 10 feet and he shot it. And what comes out of the marshmallow shooter? Marshmallow. So you're telling me you, you hit the cheetah with some marshmallows? No, my my uh, my husband did. Okay, so you hit it with some marshmallows. Yes. And he <laughs> fell to the ground. And so he, he fell. Okay, he died from marshmallows. Yes. They, they go really fast once you. Like, they go. They just, uh, we'll have more witnesses about the cheetah sighting. After the break, stay tuned to DBS. Yeah. Do you ever want to make a shirt? <laughs> well, I know many people that like making shirts. Because I work for a shirt making company called Film. The film company takes whatever you want and they print it on a shirt on the shirt. Uh, back from the break, DBS News. I'm here with uh, Margarita's husband, Jerry. Um, Jerry. Jerry. Um, Jerry. So, uh, your, your wife told me that, um, uh, you shot it with, uh, a gun. Yes, I did shoot it. Um, so, <laughs> I shot it with a marshmallow, with a marshmallow shooter. So you happen, okay, so you happen to bring your marshmallow shooter. Mm -hmm. Can you demonstrate for me what you did to the cheetah? Yes. Well, this is what happened. I was sitting there doing my manly thing, making shelves for our book, and all of a sudden I hear some screaming. And I come outside and there's a cheetah. There's a big cheetah. So I did what any man would do for, for his wife. I went and got this fine piece of equipment here and shot the cheetah with marshmallows. Okay, so um, once it's, again, can you demonstrate what you did to shoot the cheetah? Yes. So what you do first is you put the marshmallow right in there. You see it? You put it right in the hole, right there, and then you take a big breath. <laughs> well, sometimes you just gotta reload it because it might fall out. <laughs> you put it in there, you take a deep breath and fill your lungs, and you breathe in, and then blow up, like, just like so. Just like that. Oh, okay. And this happened several times before he was dead. I think he had too much sugar. So he was a diabetic uh, cheetah. That's my theory, yes. Um, yes. okay. What, do you want another demonstration? Well, I don't think uh, the viewers... I think the viewers want a demonstration. So... You put it in like so. Oh. <laughs> this may take a couple times, like I said before. Oh. <laughs> Put it in and shoot it <laughs> like so. No, nope, that was wrong. That was wrong. I need to practice a little more. <laughs> Just like that. Okay. Okay. So I'm. Um, uh, I guess now that he's been, you've been talking for a while. Oh yeah.
you probably need to recover from the horrific incident um, since you took up all the time we have. We'll be back after the break with some more witnesses. Stay tuned to DBS News. We ain't going anywhere. Oh my god, there's a cheetah! <gasps> Did we start? Oh, yeah. Uh, we started, right? Yeah, okay. Uh, hey, this is uh, Jerry. Uh, you know me. This is my uh, my catchphrase when I do my marshmallow shooting. Cool your jets, because everything's going to be okay. So, this is a new sport. Got the marshmallows. You got to get the flavored ones, of course. So, it's in the Olympics now. Starting my own business here, and uh, I got even got a new jingle. If Jerry wants to shoot a marshmallow, I'll let you just let him hmm, and cool your jets. We're back, DBS News. Um, I'm here with uh, Sherry, and uh, she incited the cheetah. Can you explain what happened? I was knitting in my home, in my rocking chair, and the cat started meowing. And I looked outside, and across the street, at my neighbor's house, I saw a cheetah. So, um, uh, how, how big exactly was the cheetah? It was this big. It was that tall. So it was like an abnormally tall cheetah. I believe so. So, um, it was across the street, so your measurements aren't very... Well, I wasn't wearing my eye con glasses either, but, you know, what? my depth perception is off, too. Okay, so, saying that it was an abnormally large cheetah is not correct. It is actually very accurate. Okay, so even though you don't have any depth to perception, it's correct. I believe so. So, um, yeah. What was it wearing? Um, it was actually wearing, uh, it was, it, it was a cheetah. It was wearing its own skin. Um, so no leopard print. Hold on, I gotta go do something. Oh! Oh! <laughs> I've fallen and I can't get up! Well, that's lost the news. I can't get up! Uh... I can't... I can't get up! Commercial break, please. Do you often fall? Trip? Or break a limb? Life Alert costs only $18.99. Call 1-800-LIFE-ALERT. Shoot. <laughs> my okay. Uh, my guy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I, my apologies. 